Here we go. We are set to go for the Miller Main. And don't forget on the way out tonight, if you buy an adult long sleeve Supercross jersey, you get a free 1985 Supercross program. No charge. The concession stands on the way out. Here we go. They're set to go! It is Burnworth, 39! Homera, second! Johnson, no, Lachine, third! Johnson, fourth! Scott Burnworth gets a whole shot on the work Suzuki! Lachine in second, Homera third, Barnett fourth, Johnson fifth. Oh, a rider down! It's a Kawasaki! It is King! Alan King is down and up again! Glover is moving at about eighth spot. Glover in eighth. Scott Burnworth in front of Old California, down on the Mexican border. On a factory, Suzuki with Lachine on his back tire. Lachine's got the lead! Lachine takes the lead, O'Meara pulls into third. It is Lachine, Burnworth, O'Meara, Barnett, and here comes Ward. Mark Barnett right behind O'Meara trying to go into third. Almost! Lachine in front, Burnworth second, O'Mara third, Barnett fourth. Now Glover's gone to fifth. Glover's on the move. Glover going in front of O'Mara. O'Mara trying to take it back. No. It is six, 39, nine and four, and Glover's on the gas. Watch Glover number four. On the outside, he goes around Burnworth. So Barnett is in second and gaining on Lachine. But a long way to go. And Glover goes around Burnworth. You've got a two-rider battle for second, and Burnworth comes back in front of Glover. Holy Toledo, over the jump. Burnworth is racing Glover. Here's the triple. No. Glover does not have the drive for the triple. He goes into third in front of Burnworth. Burnworth comes back. He stangles with Glover. Burnworth is down. It is six in front, nine in second, four in third, then one in fourth, and number five in fifth. Here's Hannah. Hannah's trying to pass Johnson for fifth. Hannah's got fifth. has gone to fifth. It is still Lachine in front. Number six, a big, big, almost insurmountable lead, but anything can happen. Lachine has crashed before in the lead. And Lachine is on his way to an overall victory if he can just hold on for a lap and a half to go. Barnett is reeling him in, but there's not enough time for Barnett to catch him. Hannah trying to go by O'Meara. But he backs off at the last minute. Here's Hannah trying to get in O'Meara for fourth. He's got him! And Bob Hanna has gone to fourth. Incredible! Right now, that's 32 Rodney Smith. White flag lap. One lap to go for Lachine. Glover's trying to get by Barnett for second spot. It's still going to be Lachine overall if he wins, finishes now. Here's the checkered flag, ladies and gentlemen. The overall winner, number six, Ronnie Lachine, Team Honda. Barnett threw a chain. Barnett has thrown a chain. Glover gets second. Oh, Hannah gets third. Barnett's got to get up the hill. O'Bear gets fourth. Barnett's
trying to get across the line. Oh, what a tough wait for Barnett. He is upset. He threw a chain in the final 30 feet. Oh, what a tough break for Barnett. Look at him. Look at him on the screen. He is so upset. What a terrible break. Barnett had, had second almost sewed up. He threw a chain. What a tough break. Your winner overall, it will be Ronnie Lachine. Second will be Brock Glover. And there goes, let's give him a round of applause. Mark Barnett, he pushes across the line. Well, Larry, I have the overall winner down here. And I'll tell you what, that's probably the wildest supercross race that we have had in years. And I'd like to hear a big round of applause for the overall winner. How about it? Two nights in a row, Ron Lachine. <laughs> Ron, a tough way to go. Yeah, it really was. I thought I had that first one wrapped up. I had a big lead, and uh, I was having a little bit of trouble in this turn here, and I tried a different line, and I hit the hay bale and knocked me down. Ron, I have no idea who finished second and third behind you, but uh, if you'd have had time while you were uh, in that lead to look up at the diamond vision, you'd have seen some wild action. They were really going nuts out there. The track looked great. Yeah, I, I think it was a lot better tonight. Uh, it didn't get as ruddy as it did last night. Uh, I had a little trouble after I fell that I hurt my shoulder and I wasn't real sure how I was going to do that one, but got another good start and uh, just took off from there.